In this lesson, I will explain to you if, else, if and else statements in processing and I will show you how to use it. Before going to a start, we will revise a last lesson very quickly that void setup we have made two blocks void setup and void draw and we were discussing this block if if mouse x is greater than 250 the background color should change and it will be the combination of 255 250 and 150 which is this is red green and blue so what is the meaning of it i will show you quickly suppose this is our canvas right and this 0 0 is the origin x and y axis both are 0 here x axis is equal to 500 pixels this one and here y axis is equal to 500 pixels sorry this is 400 it is 500 by 400 now if mouse x see here we are using the mouse on x axis at the end of this lesson this is your assignment that you instead of x you have to make it mouse y then you can make your own programming when i will move my x axis my mouse on the horizontal direction when it will be greater than 250 which is the center because it is 500 so it is it's, the color will change when it will be greater than 250 the color will change and it will be the combination of these two colors and here i have put a stroke a stroke means this line the width of this line or the thickness of this line should be 255 right and it will and the line command 250 you will see the line here i will run this for you and then you will see it so see when i will paste this on my canvas run it and you will see the canvas color will be grayish because here the background is 100 and the command is that if the mouse x is greater than 250 and this line is at 250 pixels when i will come here see it is not 250 when i will cross this line the color will change and the thickness of this line is 255 right sorry the color of this line is 255 because this is uh, white and the line is 250 0 and 250 move on to the next here i said the same programming this is the new one right the same programming if mouse x is greater than 300 means when horizontally our mouse will cross 300 pixels there will be an ellipse ellipse will draw and the color of the ellipse will be green because this 255 represents green and where the ellipse will draw suppose this is x axis this is y axis these two are the coordinates suppose 30 is here 50 is here you will see ellipse here and the color of the ellipse will be green and this is the diameter right from here or here okay so we will run this program and you will see there is only one if keep in mind there is only one if as we move ahead i will show you the difference between two times if we use if or three times so this is only if see the canvas is color is white why because i said background is 250 see my mouse is here horizontally i have to move 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 when it will be greater than 300 you will see the ellipse so fill color and this is the ellipse no ellipse ellipse no ellipse ellipse right okay a little bit extra thing in the same programming i said make a line at 300 pixels on x-axis and y-axis y only to show you only to clear you that where 300 pixels pixels lies on the canvas a stroke is zero mean this is the uh, black color so come here come here this is this is 300 when i will come here there is the ellipse no ellipse ellipse right so this is the new thing if there is a new thing i will make it red so you can see easily but here two if conditions in this scenario i have written two if condition if mouse x is greater than 100 there will be an ellipse and the color of the ellipse should be green if mouse x is greater than 400 
there should be another ellipse and the color should be the combination of 255 and 200 red and green so i will show you what is the difference and what will be the output in this example we are using two if condition okay so see here i have made these line commands here why i have made it only to in order to show you that this is 100 pixel 200 300 400 right here it says if mouse x is greater than 100 so the first line represents 100 when it is greater than 100 there is an ellipse green ellipse right first condition if second is if greater than 400 see if it is this line represent 200 no ellipse greater than 300 no ellipse greater than 400 there is an ellipse so if you are using two time if condition or three time if condition only if condition you will see all the result all the results all the functions all the commands whichever you have put it here right so one more example with the three if condition if mouse is greater than 300 if mouse is greater than 100 or if mouse is greater than 200 100 200 and 300 and there will be an ellipse of different colors but you will see all the ellipses why because in the case of if all the conditions will run when it will satisfy right so first is 300 100 and 200 when 100 so you will see the reddish cross 100 orange you can say orange ellipse second is 200 and then is 300 right in if conditions you will see all the ellipses when the conditions are satisfied right but now move on to else and sorry if and else if this is the important thing this is the new thing in if and else if suppose if i say if right 6 is greater than 2 else if if i will say suppose whatever right if i will say um, write down any condition here if 6 is greater than true the system will see the first condition if it is true it will execute it will run it will not go to else if but if i say 6 is less than 2 it is false right then if the first condition is false the system will move to the other condition and suppose other condition is if is 7 is greater than 3 then it will run this else if so in if and else if you will see one output all the time every time the system will start from the if condition if this is true it will run this system will not go to the else if but if it is false system will go to the else if you will see one but in the last example if only if if you are using if two time three time four time system will give you the output of all the ifs when the conditions are satisfied right so this is here is if and else if so i will show you i hope this is clear what i said okay so see paste it and we will run so there are two times if if mouse is greater than 300 or 200 right so see first is here greater than 100 no there is no 100 right greater than 200 yes the second one this one it says is greater than 200 again the system will start here if it is greater than 200 false system is coming here then you can see the red ellipse but if it is greater than 300 again the system will see the first condition if is greater than 300 right we are here it is greater than 300 the condition is true so you will not see the result of else if only the first condition it will run right and why i have made this lines only to show you that these are 100 200 300 okay move on to the next here i have used if and else if and else if and else if there are two times first is if and then is else if 
and then again there is else if right is you can say else if or elif okay so always the system will start from the first condition if it is true first condition the system will execute or run it will not go here it will not go here but if it is false system will go to the else if if it is true it will run this it will not go here but if it is false system will run the will see the third else if and it will run it right okay so i will copy this and we will run and i will show you here what is the output see if you cannot see here all the functions properly that is why i have written here so you can copy it make your own programming and after this because this is mouse x horizontally you have to do the same programming or just modify a little bit you can try with the rectangle or triangle or whatever but you have to use vertically on your canvas right okay so this run this program first is if it is greater than 300 right so if it is greater than 300 here right but here i have said is 200 so it when it is greater than 200 it will run this 300 if i will make this 100 then see what happens the first if i will make for you it is first if 100 because if the first condition is satisfied the system will not give you the result of second and third else if if it is greater than right see if mouse is greater than 100 there is an ellipse if mouse is greater than 400 and 200 you cannot see any ellipse because the first if condition is true so this is the difference between if and else if in only if you have only if you will see all the outputs if you have if else if else if you will see only one output whichever is true but ag again i will say that system will start from the first if condition move on to the second example next example here i have used if else if right see and else as well this is the new thing else system will see if the first condition is true same thing it will run it if and it will not go to the else if it will not go to the else but if it is false it will go to the second else if if it is false it will go to the next if all are false then it will go to the else so see here uh, see here i said if mouse x is greater than 500 500 so all if and else if are false you will see else and the else is background the color of the background will change this is the else means if i will say you okay do this 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 at the end i will say else do this right so same scenario is here because it is greater than 500 all are false so i said okay then make the background 200 100 which is just like upper place or whatever so it will go to the else but here one more thing if i will say if i will make this 700 right this is 500 if it is now 700 so now our canvas is 700 and width and it is first condition if it is greater than 500 whenever it will be greater than 500 the first if condition is satisfied this one and you will see an ellipse here right here or less but here is if it is greater than first if condition is satisfied system will not move to the second one but here if i will say suppose if i will make it 700 so first condition will not satisfy system will move to the second if condition so see second if else if else if is this is the combination of this so see here first system will check from the first the first is false because here i say if it is greater than 700 here in your canvas you can change these figures you can change the diameter of the ellipse you can change the combination of the colors but instead of mouse x use mouse y and make your own programming this is your assignment if any point is not clear you can ask me subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching